today, and today we're going to have a game of Acolyte for the Amstrad CPC. And this is a game request by Matt Myers. Okay, so this is a homebrew game. Legend tells of a land far away where imprisoned lies an Acolyte betrayed by his master and stolen of human form. His name is Glut. Well, that's an interesting name, isn't it? Hello, Glut. How you doing, mate? Yeah. Coming down the pub, mate? No, I can't. I've been captured. Oh, sorry, mate. And he needs you to free him. Okay, that's it. Welcome, adventurer, to... What's that? Baldron's Evil Castle. Enter your peril... Mortal, the magic lock is what you seek. Okay, here we are. <laughs> so there's no music. Oh, well, that's unfair. Oh, hang on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Fuck off. Fuck off a minute. So we ain't got much of the way of playing area because that seems to be... Right, fire button is jump, so we've got no fire way of firing, I don't think. So you can go up and down, so you see a door right. Oh, fuck it now. How is that fair? That's going to happen again now. How the fuck is that fair? Oh, fuck it now. Oh, come on, give me a chance. This is a little bit unfair, this game doesn't give you a fucking chance. You walk in the room and he's right on top of you. Right, I've got, I've got been nowhere really, have I? And I've always lost, a, already lost a life. Right, can I go through there? No. Out of time, you get time. It, uh, Right, as you did perish at, at the hand of the evil wizard Baldron, and your dreams of freedom are lost. Until we meet again, farewell. Okay. Okay. So we know what to do, we can't just skip that, no. Right, okay. So those green things you've got to get, so you've got to fill up that um, test tube. And once you filled that up, I think you have to. Then that turns into a key, and I think you've got to find a lock or something like that. No chance this is going to happen on this review, because I'm finding this game a little bit unfair to play. Can I get that? No. Gee, go down. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, and I've already lost a life. Gee, this is quite unfair. Get the... Nothing here then. So you've got to be quick, pretty quick in this game to react. Oh, come on. I've already lost two lives. And that... That book where you see it's on fire represents your health. So those two do things just look below me right there. So that indicates your life. So two of them have been spilt, one of them is still up. So that means I've got one life left. Gee, this this is see, give me a chance. Give the oh, fuck off. Look at that. This can be so unfair, this game. So, you walk into a room, see, that, so that all the nastiness can be right on top of you, literally when you walk into a room. Right, there's one, get the green things. So basically, that's what you go around, go around finding those green orbs. Is that anything there? Oh, fuck, no. Gee, what? 
see, I just walked into that room and that thing instantly hit me. Right. That thing tops tops up your energy. So look for them, that they will top up your energy. P I couldn't find that before. Right, can we go down? <laughs> see what I mean? Can I get out that way? No, I can't. Good job that's there, isn't it? So you've got to remember that's there. Jesus, come on! Yeah, I'm finding this game a little bit unfair. Gee! I need that. Oh, I need to go. oh I've lost a life. So I'm down here. Oh, hang on, there's some options down there. Gee! At least we're exploring a little bit more of the game now. Let's go back down there. Fuck. <laughs> that is ridiculous. That is ridiculous. Oh, nothing down here. Oh, come on. Yeah, I'm finding this quite unfair. Alright, nothing here. Get out of there. Out of time. Out of time. Why does it say out of time if I've lost all three lives? So I saw a little bit more of the game that time, but... Let's try another go. Let's try again. Yeah, I'm finding this a little bit unfair. Because you can just walk into a room and you could get instantly injured like that. It's a good job you get an energy meter in this. But that does go down quite quickly when you get hit a lot of times. See what I mean? And obviously you can't fire. Right, can't go... What's going to happen? I'm going to get instantly hit. Go up. Gee, and I've already lost a life. Jesus, come on! Oh! Oh, God! You did it! Oh. Oh. Nothing there anyway. Yeah, I'm finding this quite unfair to play. Got away with that time. Oh, my goodness! Where's that thing? Oh, now I'm going, I need to find that energy thing. At least you can replenish your energy. Oh, there's one. Ah, there's, oh, fuck off. Oh, come on. This is unfair, this game. This fucking game is unfair. I mean, we've got some nice colourful graphics going on. Um, yeah, it's unfair. It's fucking unfair this game because you can just walk into a room and that um, enemy, you know, is trying to kill you. It's on top of you. You walk in the door, at least give you a chance to go through the fucking door and explore the room. Maybe, you know, the enemy could be on the other side of the room, give you a chance to um, avoid it at least. But you go into a room, you ain't going to avoid it. And you lose energy. Yeah, I, th I think this game is quite unfair, to be honest with you. You don't get no reaction time some of the time. You know, a lot of the time, actually. And it takes away energy. You know, because there's fuck all you can do about it. But luckily, you do get some energy restore points, and you fucking will need them. But that's not the point. Why make it so unfair like that? I shouldn't be really complaining much. It's, an, it's a homebrew game, but, you know, come on. Make it a little bit, so you can at least try to avoid these things. Anyway, going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, and goodbye.